welcome back to my channel. So before we get started with this video, you guys are probably like, oh my gosh, what is going on with the background? It's totally different. Um, I am somewhere new at the moment. Um, I'm gonna do a whole video about it, like explaining where I am and everything on my vlogging channel. So if you're interested in that, definitely check out my vlogging channel. The video will go up on Friday though. So you guys are gonna have to wait, but um, yeah, so just something different. I hope it's okay. Um, this is the best I can do at the moment. Um, but I did pre-film other videos that will be going up later this week and maybe next week, we'll see. So you guys will be seeing my room here and there, but um, you guys will be seeing some of this too. So yeah, I'll just go ahead and explain that on my vlogging channel. Again, the video will be up on Friday. So anyways, with that aside, I'm going to be reviewing the Etude House My Beauty Tool Secret Brush. This is the Brush 121 Skin, and it's for the face, and this is what it looks like right here. It's kind of like the Artiste Brush, and this actually comes with the brush head as as you can see right there and also a sponge head so you can go ahead and take that off and attach the sponge tip right on it so if you're more of a sponge person then you have that option as well which is really nice so I like that but for this video I will be showing you guys how I use this brush I got a lot of requests to do kind of like you know a review on it tell you guys my thoughts and whatnot so I thought it would be fun to kind of test it out on camera for the first time um, kind of like a first impression and then tell you guys what I like about it. So I did try this out today. Um, this is the full makeup. I did my foundation and concealer with this brush. I did one half with this brush and then this half with this. Just to kind of see the difference like with the texture and like the finish that it gives you and whatnot. Um, but I didn't really notice a difference. I thought this blended just as good as this. I'm just really not used to this brush. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert a clip showing you guys that. Again, this is my first time using this brush, so it was just very kind of like awkward. I felt like I was brushing my teeth, but instead of my teeth, it's my face. So, um, I think I was putting a little bit too much pressure on it. So whenever I would do kind of like circular motion, I felt like it was just dragging the foundations. So you can kind of see that I started kind of tapping it more. That way the product really gets into my skin and it just, I don't know, more of a coverage. Um, because yeah, I just didn't want to like drag my foundation around, you know what I mean? So that's kind of what I did. I did a mixture of tapping motion and, you know, circular motions. Same with this one. I kind of do this that same method. Again, I'm just really not used to this yet, like how it's, you know, like how you're supposed to hold it and whatnot. So it's just a little bit awkward. I really should not put too much pressure on it. But so far, so good. I thought it blended my foundation very nicely. And also, this blended my concealer pretty well. Um, with my concealer, I didn't do any dragging motion. I mainly just tapped it around the area. And I thought that worked really well. And I really love the shape of this as well because it can really get in there, like underneath my eyes. And just really, you know, blend out the product. So... So far, I'm really liking this. So yeah, overall, I love this brush. I think it blended my foundation pretty well. And also the concealer, I thought, I think it looks good, you know? So I'm definitely gonna keep using this. Um, you guys will probably see me use it and like, get ready with me because I really just kinda wanna get the hang of it. I I'm just, I'm just very, very intrigued with it. I think it's so cute. I, I kind of I kind of love it. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. I, I think I love it. So that wraps up this video, guys. If you have any other video requests, feel free to leave it as a comment down below. Please do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It really helps out my channel. And subscribe if you haven't. I love you guys, and I hope to see you all soon in my next video. Mwah.